play that. And it doesn't matter if the like, man, woman, trans, anything else kind of thing. It's just, it's just fascinating to like watch when you put that song, that soundtrack with anything, you could literally just be taking the trash out and you look absolutely like un unbreakable in that moment. Imagine that you just take out the trash, but every time you take out the trash, I'll make a man out of you song just starts playing. <laughs> Could you just imagine how powerful you'd feel just, like, taking out the trash? Like, I sure as fuck would feel pretty confident. <laughs> oh, man. That would actually be amazing. That would be like with the family guy when they were talking about, like, when you have your own soundtrack going off. Um, and Peter walks around everywhere he goes as a soundtrack. And I think Lois gets shit of it eventually and, like, attacks him. So there's a couple of people over here I'm also hunting down. I can't find where the two in town went. I think one must have died and they've disappeared, but there's got to be two people over here at this housing area. I also do know my Erin girl pretty well off the back of my hand, so I don't have to think too much about where I am like this. Come on. You stood still for too long. Thank you. That's one of two. I don't know where the second one went, but you were facing forward, so I'm guessing there's one more out here. All right. Well, I'll go find him. I'll go find him personally. Oh, hello. You're in here. Got it. Got it. Let's send that over the house. Oh, shit. Fuck. Hold on. Yeah, I I wouldn't stop. Well, that would be where number two is. And I'm betting there's a third one out here. Just because that guy was, like, looking, like, over there. And this guy was in a house. So I don't think they were the two that were fighting Yep, yeah, that was unfortunate. I also, I mean, the sun grenade wasn't going to do much, but I was hopeful. You know, you can only try. I literally forgot that I'm running two snipers. It's honestly, it's not a smart gameplay. Let me just say that now. Anybody that ever sees me running around with two sniper rifles, I'm not playing to win, <laughs> clearly, because <laughs> it's, it's very unlikely that I'll get into, like, the top three and win with that I, I probably won't generally advance past the top five I think the other thing too is I don't know I know you guys definitely by now do not watch me for the purpose of like seeing me win a game like it's fantastic when it happens but like I'm glad that you're confident that I might kill something but I'm probably not going to win and that's okay you know I, I like that it's taken a lot of pressure off because I don't know if you guys get this like some of the streamers would perhaps uh the non-streamers might feel a little bit of pressure when they're playing with friends and stuff but like when you're playing a game and somebody's watching you and you get into a high pressure situation like you've got a you know i don't know top five top three situation as a buggy um it ends up getting stressful generally and i don't get too stressed about PUBG because i'm never really like taking it too seriously but um it's still like, oh, man, I haven't hit the thing. Oh, man, I can't hit the thing. And then it just keeps going like that, and then eventually they kill you, and it's like, oh, well, I'm back in the lobby now. Um, but I don't know. Without the expectation of winning, it's been a lot easier. For a while, I know I had a few people that watched me consistently and were, like, really openly disappointed every time I, like, lost, and it was not helping. It was uh, not welcoming and uplifting, I'll tell you that fucking much. Like my rules. There's got to be somebody else along here too. I'm only grabbing the car because there's no way I'm going to survive going over the bridge at this state of the game. I, I don't think... Yeah, it's going to be down here. I kind of knew from basically when we were coming in, I'm like, we'll probably end down here. I'm going to head up that way and see if I can like explore a little bit of the area. If I can not get killed, you know. There's no like, there's no death boxes or anything here. Boop. What was that? I heard something. Yeah, you don't want to stop at the first set of houses. You don't want to stop at the second. You kind of want to go on to the third set of houses. Because everybody either goes straight up to the first set of houses and heals themselves. Or the second set of houses and lays in wait for the people coming from the first set of houses. And third set of houses are where people are not expecting you to be at all. Unless, obviously, like, the plane went over there or something, you know. 
Alright, well, there's a lot of activity down in here, so... Ah! I did not see that! My car's stuck! Oh, I lodged my car and I scared the shit out of myself! <laughs> oh, man. Jesus Christ, I have had some bad jump scares tonight. This is terrible. Absolutely fucking terrible. There is a special car here. Oh, yeah, you don't just, uh, that does not spawn naturally. So, hold on. Hey, Matt. Matt, you want to come back to the window? Hold up. Let me get my other car. He's looking at the back at the moment. Nice try, Matt. <laughs> a little bit slow on the uptake there. Uh, if you've got a grenade, though, I'm fucked. Hi. Yeah, I thought so. I'm like, he could be at one of those windows. I need to get me a grenade, though. Realistically. Uh, yeah, no. I, I figured he was going to grenade any moment. So, let's get me some health. I'm kind of like sitting in the only spot where you wouldn't want to be. Like, I could get out this way and I could run in. It would be... Wait. Wait. Yeah, so I'm going to move up to Rock and see if I can get shelter from him before he spots me. All right. I think he's coming around. Yeah, he's coming around side. He thinks I'm at the edge of the building. I kind of don't have enough health. If he lobs a grenade, I am fucked. Um, I don't want to heal myself. Oh, you can climb up to second floor there. Interesting. All right. So I pretty much know. I reckon he's going to go back over to his car. I'm going to try healing after all. Been a little bit of time. He's either sitting there or he's gone back. I reckon he's gone back and inside. And if I put my gun away and I run straight over here, he's either going to pop out and shoot me. There he is. I was going to say, I'm like, he's got to be upstairs by now. There's no way he's not. I figured he had to have gone inside. Because all, all I had to do is I could have thrown something through a window. and Or I could have punched a window, actually. He might have thought I went upstairs and, like, jumped out the window. But, oh, man, that was not going anywhere. <laughs> oh, that jump scare, though. Fucking hell. That rock, I did not see that. I'll probably watch my video back and it'll be the whole way. I'll be, like, beelining down towards it. But, like, shit. I did not see it at all when I was like approaching it. Um, God damn, I've had a few really bad jump scares tonight. I haven't jumped so much for a while with my games. You know, I do actually find it really interesting when I play Seven Days to Die and I play PUBG in the same week, I actually am more likely, it seems, to get jump scared in both. Because when I only play the PUBG, I don't get jump scared as much in game. Um, and Seven Days to Die does jump scare me a little bit. And like when like a dog or something will just appear out of nowhere and, you know, I'll get mowed down or something. Um, but yeah, I find it really interesting because I was thinking about it the other week and I thought, man, it's been a while since I've been like genuinely spooked, like, you know, scared in game. And I thought, what's changed? And the only thing I could legitimately think that had changed was that I wasn't playing Seven Days to Die in my, like, weekly roster. And I know that when I was playing it, I was a lot more on edge. <laughs> I just find that funny. It's like, PUBG is fine, mostly. But when you add Seven Days to Die to PUBG, you equal, like, high intensity. What are you doing, Phoenix? It's just like did a lap and left. He's uh he's on his nightly patrol at the moment. Oh man. Oh, I like that. I like the uh brightness. It's very shiny. I can almost yep, no, I can see my face in your butt. Yep. That's the thing. I I didn't think that I was gonna say that sentence anytime soon, but that happened. <laughs> Um, oh man, what are you doing? I haven't seen, that's either like a war outfit or, that's either a war outfit or that is a, um, explorer outfit because the helmet reminds me of like 
you know, when you see like, I don't know, archaeologists and stuff or like adventurers and whatever, they kind of have that like solidish helmet, but it's like, it's borderline war. I don't know how to say it. Ah, let's see. Let's go fucking pick somewhere. Oh, man. Nimethus, if you're still around, what are you up to this weekend? What are you getting up to? Um, let's see, maybe farm. I could go here. This is a death trap. Um, I think that's school apartments. That one's not a good spot. That one's a peaceful area. That one's shit. That one's fun. Um, I could go here. I don't go there very often. I don't go down here very often, honestly. I don't mind it. I don't like it late game because there's usually a lot of people in town and they'll just shoot you. And it's very hard to kind of go in any direction because you got to go either up the mountain or you got to go out in the open field. And it kind of sucks. As I have a doctor's appointment today, that would be short on my stream. I'm having dinner with friends, going to church. I have no idea what I'm doing on Saturday. I, geez, it sounds like a bit of a busy full day. But, um, yeah, no. Sounds all right. Going out to dinner and stuff with friends also sounds pretty nice as well. Um, oh, fucking hell. Yeah, let me get oh, somebody else. Two people? Two people are here. I'll tell you what. Hold up. Let's make it one person is here. Where are you? You're going to be like right here. How did I miss? How? You were point blank, mate. I, 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 I don't know. I, I don't understand. I'm fucking keen. <laughs> I don't have a gun yet. Give me. Yeah, a shoddy will do it. Me shoddy. Yes, yeah, it should be okay. What are your plans this weekend? I have currently none. Um, I have like a simple chore, like to do the cat boxes at some point on Saturday or Sunday. Um, as a reminder, this is why I don't actually know which day it is because it's just a reminder on my phone to do that. It's the height of entertainment as I have a cat box to do. Um, and then I don't really know. I don't think we have plans. Although I think Nick said that I don't know if they're going to go play. I don't know if they're going to go play magic or what. I know that they've been playing. Um, what they've been doing. Where are you? They have been doing a D and D thing like once a month, and they had that I think last weekend or the weekend before. So no, it's not that. I think it's just standard magic that they'll be playing maybe this weekend if they do give me that let me swap this over let me put that on there give me a pan give me that this changes a few things around switch you back that sounds fun it should be fun the only thing is if it's on saturday i usually can't go because i'm usually saturday i don't finish like my editing and stuff i just generally do not finish editing usually before 6 a.m most days so i um Oh, geez, somebody's around. Yeah, so I'll probably, um, uh, what do you call it? I normally just, like, stay home and sleep because I'm normally asleep at the time when they want to do stuff. Hi, mate. All right. I don't know what gun you had. Oh, there's two of them. Three of them. Well, I've got one of these. There we go. You must have got the other one. So there's you. Oops. How am I out of ammunition? I bet you reload. I'll have to get you when I... No, no, no. Zoom in and kill him. All right, me and you, mate. Get you gone. And I'll just go outside and I'll kill things, yeah? You sound like you're just outside my building, actually. That's a bomb zone. That's at the front of my house. Hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I see you. Oops. Save by the door frame. All right, fuck it. If I have to, I'll get my shoddy and I'll go outside and kill him. Why is there so many here? Hey, you sound like you're in my house. Yeah? You in my house? Yeah, you sound like you're loading something. Yeah, don't do that. I need ammo. Where did you get yours? Give me, give me that. Um, it's going to be so loud in a hot second. Yeah, I don't know. I can't think of anything else I probably there's a couple of movies I'd like to watch like train to Busan I haven't um sat down and watched yet that I do want to watch 
Um, like I've seen it before. I need to go back inside. Hold up. Get into safety. Alright, now I'm safe. There's some ammo. Yeah, I want to watch Train to Busan again. Um, I haven't watched it for a while. Let me this. What else do I want to do? Not much else. Um, I'm trying to think of what day of the fucking week it is. It's Friday, isn't it? Let me shut that. Give me this. Tell you what, give me this gun. This will make everything so much better for me. I actually just need a backpack is what I need. Yeah, I don't know. I tend to, um, yeah, that's a backpack. Okay, I tend to like just make a, um, a list in my phone, a reminders and stuff, um, and try to, I probably could go upstairs for this. Yeah, I, I tend to just, like, take the mental strain of remembering things and put it in a checklist instead because it's a lot easier. I don't have to think about it. I, I just have to, like, look in my phone and see what I've got on. I do that for actually a lot of things. I make reminders for, like, the smallest stuff. Um, that way I don't have to overload my brain with a lot of, like, remembering stuff. Um, I'm not sure where you are. I can't see you, but you're doing some serious damage. Okay, the fuck are you? I actually don't know where this guy is. Oh, man. Yeah, as far as I can tell, I don't think I've got anything on. Um, well, apart from, like, reverting my graphics driver settings. There you are, mate. I see you. Let's go revoke your life privileges, yeah? Yeah, apart from, like, reverting my um, graphics drivers back, that's about it. And then I'll obviously test a couple of games to see how well they run on the uh, rolled back drivers, see if that helps at all. I don't think he went into the house. I don't hear anybody. Footsteps. There you are. Fucking asshole. Shooting at me before. I'm going up the mountain. See yes. Hmm, there's more people in town. I might be able to shoot them from up top, maybe. I'll see how that goes. I'll go up this way. See if I can't get one. Because I'll be all the way over there. Yeah, I don't know. It's such a glamorous life, isn't it? It's like my weekend involves doing basically nothing, changing a cat box, and my partner might go play magic. Like, that's it. <laughs> Um, I, I really don't have anything else I can think of. Um, I did some stuff on Thursday so I wouldn't have to leave the house on Saturday, which was amazing. I hate having to leave the house on Saturday. It's like, cause I, um, cause like I said, I don't normally finish like editing until like 6am. I tend to, uh, have to like, if I've got to go out to like a shop or something, I've got to wait like three extra hours uh, for shops to open or for sometimes for like, you know, Saturday, Saturday shopping times and stuff in Australia. And it's really fucking frustrating and tiring. So it's not long enough that I can go for a sleep safely and wake back up before, you know, shops close at like one or two in the afternoon because they're only open for usually like four or five hours on a Saturday or a Sunday, depending. Um, so yeah, it can be really fucking annoying if I've got to go out to get something. Um, so yeah, I, um, I did everything I had to do on Thursday night because we've got, um, late night trading on Thursday nights. I, I know that not everywhere in the world is aware of that, but yeah, Thursday nights, most stores tend to stay open. I say most, it's entirely up to the business. Um, they can stay open for like a few hours. Usually most will stay open until about 9 PM. So if you've got a day job, if you have an unusual sleep cycle or, you know, if you're a night worker or something like that, you can still get access to stuff that you require, um, you know, on a Thursday night, like postal service and stuff like that normally stays open for like one extra hour, stuff like that. So people can get to it outside of like work hours, stuff like that. Um, it's just little things, but yeah. Um, I know that there's going to be a bunch of people down here. I'm not particularly thrilled about this, especially since the zone is coming in on me hard. Okay, now I've got to put my gun away to get some speed up. 
There's also somebody coming in and over in a helicopter. Like they're gonna, I'm not quite sure where it is. I think it's further ahead. Like there somewhere, it's, it's covered in the trees. Either way, I'm basically running towards a lot of people. Because there's always a lot of people at apartments and the school. And they're in zone and I am not. So I am just a sitting duck doing this. Running between the apartments is also not smart. I can maybe go around here. I've got a little bit of health. And I'm not that far away, so maybe I can make it. We'll see. Oh, hello. Hold up. Jesus Christ, you absolutely laid into me. All right. Yeah, I've got a six times scope. Have fun. You'll be great with that. Um... Yeah, let me have a look at my fucking calendar because I'm pretty sure I've got, like, nothing on. Oh, man. Yep, cat boxes, that's it. <laughs> that's my weekend. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, no, I thought I had other stuff. <laughs> yeah, so um, there's probably, like, a tip that people can use for, like, lessening brain strain and, like, uh, stuff that you have to remember from day to day and whatever. Um, so if you if you're somebody that's got like a lot on, a lot happening, stuff like that, like there's the easiest way to like give your brain a bit of reprieve from that is to literally just um like make a reminder in your phone and just or put a calendar event. So all you gotta do is open it to see what you've got on. And it's it's pretty easy to like stay mentally more relaxed that way. I've kind of like always done that. I even used to do it at work. It would be like, you know, um, I don't know. People would walk past and they'd be like, hey, can you remind me to like, I don't know, go get a coffee in like five minutes or something like that? And I'd be, sure thing, no problem. And I'd literally make a calendar reminder, remind such and such to go have a coffee in five minutes. They'd be like, how do you remember all this stuff? And I'm like, I use a calendar. I don't have to remember it. I've got other stuff to do. Um, like literally they themselves could also have made a calendar entry. I'm aware of that, but you know, it's a simple task that somebody asks you and they rely on you and you're consistent with like organization and timing and stuff. Yeah. Why not? How am I doing with this stuff anyway? I placed in the top, top 10, five times. Out of, what, 19 matches for the season? Oh, we must be in a different season. Maybe that's what that's all about, with the boxes and stuff. <laughs> okay, I won't look at my shit. Uh, every time I try to look at my stats, the game just goes no. Mind you, I prefer playing Erin Gale in daytime. It's much nicer. I also like the reindeer outfit a lot. It needs a better tail, though. Um, I also half considered playing uh PUBG like a little bit longer like I'll see how I feel about that because usually I finish PUBG at like 1 15 or 1 30 depending on um when the last game ends I normally aim for like 1 15 but the last one will sometimes go over so it can go for longer and stuff but I have had a couple of short streams all week and I do have energy and I don't like I'm gonna I'm gonna say this now that I don't think it's gonna completely destroy me to stay like maybe an extra 20 30 minutes I hope considering I've taken like two streams this week where I think I finished like half an hour and an hour earlier it probably just kept me for the whole weekend probably be like 15 minutes too long or some shit like that my brain will just be like why did you do that to me again <laughs> I don't know I'm going to get some of the houses down here, the little three cluster here. Also, if anybody has been wondering, I have like a, a donation goal going at the moment. I haven't mentioned it because it's like pretty subtle, bright orange in the corner and stuff. But I have a chance to upgrade my internet to fiber um, before the end of the month, basically for only like 120 bucks for the entire year. So, um, with paying off an air conditioner, um, I don't really have that spare right now. But, like, if anybody wants to contribute towards that so that I could have better internet for streaming and gaming and shit, that would be incredibly amazing. Um, I made it a donation goal and not, like, a bit cheer or something like that because the bits 
I would require twice the amount cheered than the actual 120. So that would be a bit much. <laughs> Welcome in, Cap'n and Raiders. How was your how was your stream? What were you up to? I can hold up. I I forgot how to crouch. <laughs> you raided me. I forgot how to crouch. How do I lay down? Hold on, hold on. Um, there we go. I might be able to get it now. Yeah, how you doing, Cap'n and Raiders? Welcome in. Um, what were you playing? What were you doing? I'm playing PUBG. Um, oh fuck, Rika, thank you for the follow. So um, yeah, so I play PUBG on Fridays, and it's really just for fun. So everybody's welcome to like chat and um, you know basically troll me with like sound alerts and stuff because all my sound alerts are like maximum volume in my headset and um it's not that loud for you guys so i can hear like all footsteps and stuff in the game but like every every little thing that happens in stream is like like startling um i've had like a few good spooks tonight um thank you uh Sorry, uh, streamers, let me get my thing. There we go. Brain's working now, maybe. Mate, can you not? Oh, fuck, hold up. Where did I go? Hide. No, no, no. Sit here, he'll get run over. I'll read your comment while this guy gets run over. Oh, he can shoot from it. Oh, fuck that, I'm laying down. I don't think he saw me. This is streamers good. I stream Skull and Bones. It's a pirate f uh, boat fight game. Oh yeah, I think I've actually heard of that. Sorry, I just had this, this guy's like rolled up and you know what I'm gonna do, right? Oh, hold up. Can I, I want your car. Well, you're inside. Uh, thank you. See ya. <laughs> oh no, he got my tires. Asshole, I can go in reverse. I wasn't getting out of there. <laughs> That's fine. Oh, man. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, Undead Ronin. Oh, goodness me. Yeah, fucking hell. Now that I can kind of think. Um, yeah, so I can welcome in. I'm a prolic. I stream a variety of games on a regular schedule every week with a random games night on Wednesday and a monthly art stream at the end of the month on a Wednesday. And I play PUBG basically every Friday to kind of like kick back and chill with everybody and just like have a big old chat. I'm not playing to try to win. I don't care if I die. I just think it's kind of funny. Um, my career kind of like is like up and down all over the place. At the moment we're going down, but that's okay. We, we got up near the top earlier, so that's fun. Um, yeah, I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. <laughs> But yeah, welcome in. Thank you for rating me, Cap'n. Thank you for um, trusting me with your community. And um, yeah, for anybody that hasn't seen me before, I also play RimWorld every week and I'm starting to play Seven Days to Die again every week on like warrior mode while I've got integration on. So people are just killing me left, right and center and it's amazing. Um, I'm trying to build in the wastelands, which is like, oh God, um and then yeah uh thursdays might change so what i've got in my thursday schedule at the moment which was diablo may change um because i just finished the game this 